happy Thursday. So, having talked yesterday about routine, I was talking to a friend yesterday, and he had mentioned, not even in relation to what I was talking about, just mentioned that word spiritual, and that someone told him that the root of spiritual is ritual, which routine, and I was like, oh, that's cool, that's really awesome. So, I looked it up, and yes, the root of the word looks like spiritual, but when you do the history of the word, the root of spiritual is not ritual. It is spiritus or spiritua, spiritas. I don't, I'm horrible at pronunciation, but spiritus, which is Latin for breath, which is kind of amazing that the essential root of spirit is breath, which makes a lot of sense as well. And that the root further down uh, or other roots of breath are to aspire or inspire, and that to conspire is to breathe together. Um, yeah, the origin of words, pretty amazing. Um, and I love to break that stuff down and to see where it, li where it is in my life. And to inspire and to aspire are part of spirit because as, as something else that I read, it draws back to, um, in some definitions, uh, breath of God, and to be inspired is to be, to have the breath, to have an energy or a breath of God. Pretty amazing. Um, yeah, so I'm inspired, I'm grateful, and uh, look, I, the spiritual path is to uncover and discover and discard, at least for me, to continue to seek. And seeking is an act of, is active. Like, we don't, I'm, you don't just kind of like, oh, I'm kind of looking. Like, to seek, to be inspired, I, it makes so much sense when I, when I go deeper. So hopefully you're inspired today. Um, you are spirit, you are breath. That makes sense. Like, that makes sense. I don't know. Much love.